Veya Kiev system, Enigma sector, Barracks, TCS Concordia. Paladin, good to see you're still on board. Guess you've heard how Hobbs saved Olympus Station. Aye, laddie, that I have. I didn't believe it, though. You're not the kind to sit on the sidelines. Might as well have. No matter what I do, his lordship the Admiral will twist it around to make me look bad. So you're flying to make a hero of yourself then? No, James, I'm flying to stop the damn furballs from conquering our whole race. Then what does it matter to Tolwyn think what Tolwyn thinks of you or anyone else? Because if Tolwyn gets his wish, I'll never fly against the Kilrathi again. And if that happens, the offer stands. Thanks, James, but I can do more good here than as, as long as I can keep flying. Perhaps, lad, there's more than one way to fight a war. What are you talking about, James? Just what are you into? I can't tell you, lad, unless you're willing to sign on. Sounds like some secret apps. But in the meantime, Rick, you watch yourself. I hear the Kilrathi called off their attack on Gorakar, which left the Concordia free to check out Novaya Kiev. But it makes no sense for the Kilrathi to pull back now. The cats are preparing for something big, I'm sure of it. Yeah, I bet. Let's find out what's going on. Flight deck, TCS Concordia. Suited up and ready for launch trip? As soon as you tell me what's up, Angel. The Kilrathi have fallen back from Gorakar, and we followed them here to Novaya Kiev. They've retreated from the system as well. Allowing us to retake it. Even so, we've detected a few enemy vessels and stations left behind. You'll be going after a supply depot on the far side of Novaya Kiev. We think the Gilrathi plan to use it as a refueling station on their next events. You'll fly a broadsword. Doomsday will be on your wing. Wonderful. I can give this assignment to Jazz if you prefer, Reap. I'll fly it, Angel. First, you'll proceed on to the jump point on your nav map and jump across the system. There, you'll rendezvous with one of our tankers and refuel. From there, continue to the supply depot. It should be undefended and easy target. Your nav computer will have complete data. Got it, Angel. Doomsday and your gunnery crew are waiting on the flight deck. Bon chance, mon ami. Thanks. What does that mean? Good chance? Good luck, maybe? My goodness, it's been a long time since I've flown one of these. Let's get moving! <sighs> I don't even know if I can do this today. Alright, J for jump. What do we got here? We got the Valdez. Oh, this is <laughs> Valdez. This is Rick. Rip Ramon. Requesting permission to refuel. Over. Affirmative.
Negative. You are clear to refuel. Dang, you look like a pig. Let's go. We're in trouble now. Yeah, we sure are. All right, breaking attack. Affirmative, sir. Yeah, these things are so fast. I, I hate it when you do that. They're really hard to, uh, to tell where they're gonna go. So they're pretty skittish. So. The ITTS will tell you what it should be, but that's always, always should be just taken as a general guide because it just projects where it's going to go at if it continues on in a straight line, which it's current, you know, most of the time it doesn't fly in straight lines. It curves a lot, so you have to kind of guess where they're going to end up, which is fine. You don't want to know exactly where to shoot. Otherwise, the game would just be too easy. It was like you have laser guns, but none. They, of course, they don't. They're not even close to the speed of light because then all you, it'd be just point and click and die. Just like point at them, hold it for a while, and it would seem like it would be pretty easy. But you'd have to completely change the way you do a space battle. To add actual weapons that moved at the speed of light. That'd be pretty sweet. Same with like, you know, bullets. Like even bullets in this game move slower than real bullets do. Your laser cannons probably move slower than bullets do. There's one more somewhere. Here we go. What are you doing so far off and not attacking anybody? Thank you for dying so quickly. I appreciate that very much. Has somebody else to go kill right now. As soon as I can get in range, I will un- Oh, this guy's gonna kill me first. I better aim at this guy. One capital ship down. One capital ship down. Should be more excited, Doomsday. Just killed a whole bunch of kill ratchies. One capital ship down. You, they got, you count that as your kill too, you bastard. All right, let's just get moving. None of us are coughing sparks. We're doing good We're so far. In trouble now. Yep, and we sure are. Affirmative, sir. Breaking attack. All right, we got, we got your Jal Kays. Let's speed up. These guys suck. Not the Jal Kays. I mean, this actual the the space station is harder than these ships are, and that's for damn sure. I'm already in the flak of those ships, which fucking sucks. All right. All right, there's one less fighter shooting me down. There's two. Wow, did you? Sh who killed that one? Good thing the uh, fighter cover sucks. But dang. I really hate the rear turrets and like all the ships of this game. They're so powerful. I couldn't say if they're overpowered or not. Maybe that's the way they should really be. But damn, they suck. Alright, let's see if we can uh, do any good here. Oh crap, I hate that. Ah! Alright, I'm pulling out while I still can. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it. Please, Doomsday, get something. Get one of those guys, please, Doomsday. Please, please. I've never. I hope you'll survive uh... this. <laughs> Another dead ape. The reason I say that is because this is. This part is really just ridiculously freaking hard. I, sh uh, I 
hate the fact that if I pull my nose up just slightly above it, then I lose the lock. You, are you serious? I lose the lock if I'm dr I'm going directly at it. And I just lose sight of it and it just goes, uh, unlocks. Ah, why make it so damn hard? It doesn't make any sense to make it hard like that. It just makes it dumb. So now I get to sit here and wait for, I don't know, two minutes maybe? Comment how stupid this is. Just wait for my shields to slowly recharge. And I'm going to get fried anyways. Because these ships, it doesn't matter how close they are. They, they'll just beat the crap out of you, that's for sure. Caused me to whine and mope and complain for a while. I can't shoot down at either of these ships. I can't get close to either of them to shoot them down. You can't dodge the flak, you just take it. Like, look, how am I supposed to, what am I dodging? Nothing's really actually hitting me. Is it? Is anything actually really hitting me? There we go, there's a torpedo away. And I'm dead. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Dear Lord, let me live. Let me live, dear. Oh, no, I'm going straight at it. Oh, did I actually survive this one? Okay, as long as it's in my rear view. Oh. Oh, I thought he was going to die. Okay. Slow down a little bit. Actually, a lot of it. Wait for my shields to recharge again. Actually, I think I actually might do this one. Wow. Uh, buy myself a beer after this. I feel like I need it. You beat a, wishing it, a mission in Wing Commander 2, man. You feel like you really accomplished something. I'm gonna go tell somebody. Eureka! We found it! The solution! I finally beat the game! Dear God! Alright, it's not even the middle of the game yet, I don't think. The mission 13. Yeah, something like that. Let's uh, let's creep a little bit on, because I have no patience. I want to see if I can get a lock on this guy first. I can see it, but I can't lock onto him. All right, now I can slow down. I don't know this guy's range, but their range is super long. And if you fire a torpedo from this from this distance, it will shoot it out of the sky before it gets there, which is really convenient. I shouldn't need to have to fire a torpedo at this enemy craft, but I'm gonna try to get two locks on it. Watch, watch it. Look how slow that torpedo goes. I'm going at zero. I wonder if it's gonna make it. That'd be cool if it did. It did. It made it. Ram on, we're reading a distress beacon. What is your situation? My wingman ejected. Search and rescue is on the way, Ram on. Continue your mission alone. Affirmative, Ram on out. No, I'm not gonna do that, guys. I'm really not gonna do that. I can see him floating in the distance. I have three tractor beans on this thing. I'm going to pick him up. I would not let my friend sit in the vacuum of space. I don't know how much of a friend Doomsday is, but I'm not going to let him sit in the vacuum of space forever. The fact that he ejected means that he should be propelling in one direction. But, you know, I appreciate the fact that I don't have to be chasing him down at full speed in order to be able to save his life. Yes, yeah, not right, Doomsday. All right, let's check on our right side. Change guns to tractor beam. Fire away. I think this is the first time I've ever picking something up in Wing Commander 2, you know. Since I was since a long time at least. No, screw search and rescue. I found him. I got him. As long as there's no more enemies. What's that on my scopes? 
Hey, Valdez, is that you? Can't target. Uh, it's a Hector. So it's time to jump back home, and I really, if I get attacked on the way home, I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> Especially if I get shot at this guy. Like, what the hell? Oh, see, hey, I jump out at full speed. Yes. We have to jump again? No, I shouldn't. That doesn't make any sense. I just jumped. Are you serious? All right, there's got to be a way to switch this inside here. Why can't I pull this up? <sighs> this is seriously no good. Are you serious? I don't know how to fix this problem. If you don't know what kind of what the problem I'm under is, I, it seems like I didn't make it to the last nav point and jumped too early. Therefore, my nav computer says I need to go back to the other system to tag that wave mark before I can plot my next nav point to the Concordia, which I'm trying to fly to. Of course, it won't give me any nav coordinates, and it says I'm out of fuel. I don't know why I would have to refuel twice on a mission that's just there and back. I didn't have to jump to get there. I mean, to, I didn't have to jump twice. I only jumped once. It says it's a jump point, but my capacitors are empty. This game is bugged, man. I'm hoping that the Concordia will show up sometime soon. Gosh, this is stupid. If I fail this mission because of this, I think I'm going to have to take a long break from this game because I'm I already did take a long break from this game man this game is tough and the bugs if it kills it like this man I'm gonna be really upset because I put a lot of work into this mission right I'm just flying off into some random ass direction now I should be here why can I not plot a nav course is there something I have to do Shut up. What the hell? Auto. It keeps going auto, then it goes like... It doesn't make any sense. 70,069. Alright. This is gonna be a long wait. Might as well get some snacks and some drink. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's see if this does anything. Autopilot, see what happens. Oh, I actually worked that time. Okay, hey, maybe I did it. Concordia, this is Rip Ramon requesting permission to land. Over. Affirmative, you are clear to land. Ah. Whew. And why do you give me the sad music, man? You make me so nervous. Welcome back, sir. Angel wants to see you in her office. Colonel Devereaux's office, TCS Concordia. Welcome back, messieurs. Doomsday, I see you survived your little float in space. I will speak to you about the ship you lost later. Please, give me your report. Ran into a couple of Kilrathi tankers. They're both history. Then we moved on to the depot. It wasn't much of a challenge. It wasn't much of a challenge? Crazy? 
I see you destroyed 8 of those enemy fighters, Reap. And Doomsday got 2 of them. I'm surprised. I'm surprised we survived this, ma'am. You were very lucky, Doomsday. We lost one of the younger pilots today. Stingray's wingman, Dallas, didn't make it home. I know you feel you have something to prove, Reap. But I do not wish to lose any more pilots. You are dismissed, gentlemen. You don't give us such crazy missions. Hey guys, thanks for watching this week's installment of Wing Commander 2. Let me know what you think in the comments, like or dislike, and remember to subscribe. We got plenty more Wing Commander coming your way. So I will see you next time.